Um, hi, today I'm going to be playing I Just Stay in Your Arms. It's like the first part where it starts, and then I just stop there, and then I'll play a little bit of Beethoven, and then I'll play, uh, then I'll play Clocks, uh, the first part of Clocks by Coldplay. I'll, I'll teach you a couple of those, and then I'll play, um, Heart. And so, if you ever saw the commercial, what do I do? Da 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 Lollipops, lollipops, that's where heart and soul came from. I think. First I'm gonna first I'm gonna play I uh the first part of I just stay in your arms. <laughs> to this one and this one. Then you play this. Alright. Okay. Alright, so you got that part. You gotta go to E and then you go to A. Alright? And then as soon as you do this part, then you have to switch. You keep this one here and keep playing. But then you have to go to G. Right. Then you have to go to G. This G right here. Also play this if you're just playing with the right hand. So you gotta play B, then you gotta play C sharp, and then you gotta play E. Alright, now let's now let's play this all together. And see the the left hand the left the I am you have to remove your left hand at the last second and play with just your right hand on this chord. So your left hand will keep doing this until you have to quickly switch over over here. Okay? So that's how you that's how you play uh, that. All right, next one. I will be playing Clocks by Coldplay. first part of it. I'm just teaching you the first part of these songs. And, 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 uh, if you ever find a song that you like and you want me to teach you the first part of it, I'll be sure to do that for you. Here's how you play uh, Claps by Coldplay. See, you got, see, you have to place your hand over here. See, you gotta just lay it out like here. You got your first finger, second finger, third finger, fourth finger, and the fifth finger. So you gotta play that. But the first chord you'll be playing E sharp, then you're gonna be playing an A sharp, and I'm gonna be playing a G. Alright, see how it does that? See, after you play the couple chords, then you have to go and do C sharp, then you gotta do A sharp. Oh, wait, it's either A sharp or A flat or something like that. And then you go and wait, hold on. Yeah, see it's like that, it repeat. Okay, you gotta do that. And then you move, then you move your pinky finger, well basically your whole hand. Then you go to C, then you go to C sharp, and then you go to F. Oh wait, no. Hold on. Alright, see that's how you play it. Alright, you don't play 
play together, otherwise it'll sound horrible. Alright, here's the next one. <laughs> I won't be doing that again. Let's see, it fell into my lap before it could fall on the floor. Alright, so then I'm gonna play Heart and Soul. <laughs> So there's that part. Now you've got to be playing like this. Now you've got to have your three third finger up here on the C. So you play that at first, but you will be moving up. All right. So you go one, two, three. You gotta do that with your hands up. Uh, most of the time, you have to play when you play hard. So you have to do that. All right now. C C C. E G C. E. All right. So hopefully you learn how to play that. Alright, if, if, if you want me to play the rest, it's going to be real difficult because you'll need a second partner that really knows how to play piano. Alright, and then there's this and then there's this other one, Beethoven. It's, it's a difficult song and I'm still having trouble with it, so if I urge in the middle of the song, don't worry. Just, I haven't learned all of it. I haven't gone to the part where you play like flower type of melody thingy. they get this is where you play again with that thing so you have to move sort of fast it's gonna be real difficult showing you but I'll try my best I'll put it on the side of the piano so that I can I could play it then you'll see it I'm gonna put it wait yeah I'll put it right here okay just try and try and follow where I'm putting it and I've got my hand all right see I've got my right hand in the center of the piano and I've got my left hand over these keys. Alright, so the fifth finger will be playing an E, and I'll be moving a lot during the thing, alright? So, then I go E, E, E flat, I think. And then I go down to D. playing this wrong. I've actually got the notes here. If you want to look at it, I wrote down all the notes for the song. Alright, here. I got all the notes. All I need you guys to do is like read the notes, like pause, 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 pause the video, and then look at the notes. See, I've got the notes right here, just in case you never saw it. Alright. Now I'm going to zoom out, and I'm going to tip it to the side, so that you get more coverage of the whole thing. Okay, now I got it there for about five, four, three, two, one. Okay, there. Hopefully you saw it. Didn't. I'll do the video again. All right. Bye. Hope you learned. I'll teach you next time. Bye.